my dad was in the Olympics when I was one years old. Um, and then growing up, my mom won her national championship for Canada for pole vault when I was six. Um, and so I've just always been involved in my entire family, pretty much as, pro as professional athletes. So um, yeah, growing up, I always knew I wanted to be a professional athlete. I knew I wanted to do either a different event, kind of wanted to uh, pave my own way, but um, yeah, I definitely knew I wanted to be an athlete. When I was 10 years old, I got hit in the head with a golf ball um, and got paralyzed in the whole right side of my body. Um, and I actually didn't get involved into parasport until last year. Um, I, um, right when I got injured, I kind of, my rehab was track and field. Um, and so um, I, in, in high school, I ended up uh, becoming runner up in cross, in, in, in cross country and got a scholarship to Furman. And then I transferred to South Alabama. And um, I was kind of not happy with the way that my track and field career ended. Um, and I, I, I knew there was a different chapter to the ending. I didn't want it to end uh, the way it did. And so my mom um, said that she always knew that para sports was an avenue that I could, that I could go down. Um, and so um, she presented that to me. And then so we contacted FLEX Canada and wanted to see, you know, what the opportunities were. Because honestly, I personally didn't know there was an opportunity for me. Um, but my mom said she always did. And she, she said she was just waiting to talking about it and pull it at the right time. Yeah, some of my goals this year, I want to go under 350 in the 1500, go under 150 in the 800. Those are my two big goals. And then winning worlds and Pan Ams are my championship goals.